Good morning, guys. Happy Thursday. I can't believe it's already Thursday, almost the end of the week already. It's been such a crazy week, but I thought I'd start the vlog a little bit early and show you guys what's going on out there. It is so noisy. And actually, I don't, I don't have a good shot, but it is so noisy. There's like a bunch of green parrots flying around back there. Can you guys see? This is not a good shot. Okay, let me see if I can get out here and get you guys a better shot. Oh my gosh. Do you hear that? Oh, there it is. Oh my gosh. There's so many parrots. I'm standing out here. I'm a little scared. That's not like aggressive calling, right? Maybe it's mating season. I don't know. There's so many though all around like these few houses. It's <laughs> so loud. My gosh. I just see some like flying here, flying there. Alright, I'm back in. I know Power hates birds, so he probably hates seeing all those birds outside, but I mean, I don't really care. They are noisy, but as long as they stay away from my car, <laughs> I don't really care that much. Anyways, Power's dropping off the kids at school, and I'm making my coffee. You know, there was this um, deal at Costco's on sale, so it was two of these jugs, the Coffee Mate Vanilla flavor, for only $6. The last time I was there, I was like, dang, that's a good deal. The only thing is I don't like this. Like when you buy it at the normal market, the smaller size, you get the little the, li the little thing with the little pour spout, you know, that makes it a little easier. So that's the only thing. I probably, I wonder if it fits. I probably should have saved it from the last one. And I attached it here. But anyways, that's okay. And I was like, I'm always afraid I'm going to spill. Here we go. Yeah. Now I'm ready to go to work in my robe. <laughs> All right, picking up the kids from school. I really wish I had that umbrella. I don't have an umbrella. I think it's still in Power's car. But at least I don't think I'm late today. There's still parents kind of like walking every single time, man. I like I'm cutting it so close. The other time, the other day when I picked them up, Uriah was the last one to get picked up, <laughs> which was fine. Like there were still a lot of kids, you know, over there, but he he was one of the last ones to get picked up. So I'm just trying to walk quickly. I got to remember to bring an umbrella or a hat or something. Okay, got Uriah. Let's go wait by the shaded got... tree. Uh, why didn't you bring an umbrella? I know. I know. Because the teacher did not recognize me. That happened again, huh? Yeah. Uriah's all like, thank you. Uriah's like, oh, she failed the test again. I've been just waiting across the street under the shady tree. Yeah, so don't touch it or else your hands will get very sticky. Yep. Boys are enjoying some leftover McDonald's. How are your ham your cheeseburgers? Good. Yeah. You happy that we saved them for today? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Apparently, PJ didn't eat the entree of his lunch. He said it was like meat and rice. Is that what you said? And it was not good. But how did you know if you didn't even try it? I once said it wasn't good, and I just I wasn't feeling it. <laughs> you just weren't feeling it. So what did you eat? Apple. Were they like sliced apples in a bag? Oh. Did you drink your milk at least? Oh, good. You're right. Did you have your lunch? Did you eat your rice and your meat? 
Mm-hmm. You did? Was it good? Mm, it was. Okay, good. Uriah does like rice and meat. <laughs> Okay, so it's after five o'clock. I don't know exactly what time is it. What time is it? Oh, it's like 5.30, closer to 5.30. So I am getting dinner started. <laughs> what are you doing, you crazy boy? Egg inside of egg, inside of egg, inside of egg. One of your favorite things. Awesome. Anyways, as I was saying, I'm getting dinner started. I kind of have a lot going on today. I don't know why, but I haven't been cooking that much lately because I've been really busy with work and after work, I just, I just been too tired. So um, I'm gonna cook some healthy food today because I went to the market yesterday. I'm gonna do a pesto salmon. So I bought this filet of salmon. I got basil pesto pesto from Costco got butter I got garlic salt so that's gonna be for the boys and then when we were at uh, Jocelyn's place some time ago she served salmon with quinoa and I had to get it so I got the quinoa from Costco Uriah loved it so much remember the quinoa at auntie's house yeah so I, I rinsed I it why did you eat the quinoa? Okay, so I rinsed it. I'm gonna cook it in the instant pot. Um, I had to look up a recipe, but it seems pretty simple. Just like saute, do I saute garlic? I can't remember. I'm gonna saute garlic, <laughs> some salt, um, toast up the quinoa, add some water, add some seasoning, and then basically cook it. Zero pressure for, or not zero pressure, high pressure for zero minutes, and then just let it um, um, naturally depressurize for about 12 minutes, or just basically leave it alone. Let it steam, and then that's it. And then hopefully it'll be as good as <laughs> when Jocelyn made it. Um, and so yeah, so that's for the boys. And then for me, I bought ingredients to make a Thai soup, which I do intend on making. So let me just do this first. So I can get this going. Um, I have the oven on um, preheating. Just do this. Is that too much butter? Can you have too much butter? <laughs> I don't know. I'm just. I was just eyeballing it. And so let me just drop some pesto. Is that enough? Maybe a little more. I know. I know PJ and Power likes their pesto. There's the oven. All right, looks really good. All right, so here's the before shot. Really hope it turns out. And manual. Zero minutes. Okay, I'm sorry guys. I'm not used to this. So I'm gonna go on a little rant here. I bought a can of mushrooms and a can of quail eggs because that's how Jocelyn made her soup and it was really, really good. So I bought them. They're not cheap. They're like two something a, a can. I mean, like I said, I don't really open canned goods too often, but I thought that they would be like packed. This is not packed. I feel like I got gypped. Mainly just water. I mean, if it was just this little bit of mushroom, I probably would have just bought like a t container of fresh mushrooms. <laughs> what the heck? After I dumped out all the water, this is all I get, which is really interesting. Anyways, this is for my soup. Um, quinoa is almost done. It's just steaming. I hope it turns out good. Salmon's out. I think it's good. I don't know. All right, I should probably poke it and make sure it's cooked oh I don't think it is actually no wow my first crack at quinoa and it turned out really good quinoa, quinoa. Well, I didn't even taste it yet though you excited yeah how's the quinoa Uriah we can't even wait is this too hot does it taste good huh is it yummy or not 
good. Is it yummy? It's so good. It's so good. Uriah wanted lots of uh, quinoa, not that much salmon. PJ wanted lots of salmon, not that much quinoa. Opposites. Lots of salmon. Mmm. Mm. How's the salmon cooked? Perfectly. What makes it good? Everything. <laughs> it's also very tender. Very tender. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at my soup, my Tom Kha soup. Let me see if I can mix it for you guys so you guys can see all the deliciousness inside. Ooh, got chunks of fish. This is swai fish that I bought from the market. Some of my t mom's tomatoes. I was trying not to cook it too long, but kind of did, kind of turned to mush. How's your soup? It's good. I shouldn't have added these extra chilies though. So spicy. <laughs> it smells good. I want, I want some. You want to try some? What kind of egg is that? A quail egg? Uh -huh. Whoa. Whoa. You didn't have it before? I don't want a quail egg. Mom, I just want the eggs. Those are my favorite okay. ones. Okay, I'll put it in your bowl. Yes! I love eggs. <laughs> quail roll, it, egg. roll it around your quinoa because it might be a little spicy. It's hot. Hot. You, it's just uncomfortable, right? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> no, it hurts. Do I have to cut these one day? <laughs> Look, there's more space on the top. There's more space on the top, so that's why I want you to stand a little bit. <laughs> okay, you get this one out. <laughs> How did you get it in? Did you have your arm turned like this? No? Did it go in straight like this? Yeah. Okay, okay. Which one hurts? Can you turn it like this? Do the same thing. Arms up all the way, all the way to the top. All the way, turn it, turn it. There you go, my goodness. You okay? You need, you need ice pack? No. He asked for a lollipop. Are you gonna put your arms in the little slots again? No. no. Did you learn your lesson? Yes. Okay. Do you want me to help you? You're okay now? For a minute there, I was like, oh no, this is not looking good. But what I do know about these chairs is that it slants down. So obviously here is going to be skinnier than up here. So that was my strategy. I was like, go all the way up. But I was kind of freaking out because he was freaking out. And it just like, I couldn't get it past his elbows. It looks okay now. Let me see your arm. You're okay. 
See, no bleeding. Just a little bit of red right here, but that's it, right? No bruises, no nothing. He's fine. I was also freaking out because Power had stepped out and so I was home alone. And when he was crying, I was like, Help, come on! You got stuck? Where? Get out! In the chair! In the chair? <laughs> you stopped to get Charo ice cream! I sent you a picture. I said I couldn't resist. Where were you stuck? Show your dad. Show him where. Don't put it in. Just show him how. Both arms, daddy. Both arms! How'd you get him out? I just made him go all the way to the top. And then I got one arm out first, and then the other one came out. Ay, ay, ay. And he was screaming and crying. And then he's like, hey, yeah, PJ, don't make fun. And then he was like, maybe we're going to have to cut these chairs. If I was were, like, if, if we have to, really yes. Stuck, we would cut the chairs, yes, okay? if you were really stuck, we would cut the chairs. Don't worry, right? I was really stuck. Yeah, but mommy well, helped you. Stuck, you couldn't come out. All right, PJ, do you want dessert or not? Yeah. Dessert! Well, I already have one. Oh, that's true. That's your dessert. <laughs> <laughs> How is it? Guess, good? guess you're not on keto. Yeah. When power falls off, he falls off. He makes it worth it. No, it's okay. What kind is that? It looks Hazelnut. good. Hazelnut. Oh. Yeah, it looks like a, almost like an almond roca. Mm. Remember last time we got it and PJ, all he did was eat the ice cream? I knew that's all I wanted. I want some ice cream. I never tried the ice cream. Get a spoon. You want a spoon, right? The hog and all of it. I realize. Here we go. I don't think I'll be able Well, it just, it happened very fast and this boy was crying, screaming. Alright guys, that is a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. If you like, give us a thumbs up, comment below, subscribe if you haven't, and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye guys.